Hi everyone, it's Kristen. Welcome back to Bailey Cabin. I have my July Stitch Fix here. Happy to share with you another requested summer trends box. So let's take a look and see what I got. And if you're not uh, familiar with Stitch Fix, it is a subscription fashion box that you can select to get on a recurring basis. You actually can decide how often you want the box every two weeks, three weeks, four weeks, two months, and you can request them on demand. The styling fee is $20 and that is credited back to anything that you purchase from your box. And I have been a Stitch Fix customer for a long time, so I was given the opportunity to do the pass, which is a one-time charge of $49 and there are no styling fees for a year and the 49 dollars does apply to a box as well so it's a really um uh, cost economical uh way to get your fixes so i can essentially do unlimited fixes with no added styling fee for a year and I get mine about every four weeks and sometimes if I'm looking for something in particular that I need to add to my wardrobe I'll speed that along. They do send you a card with styling ideas so each of your pieces what you might pair them with and a note from your stylist and let's see just a personal note how you might use them and why your stylist picked them for you it's kind of a nice touch for that and then we have our price list for all the items that are in our box the other thing they send you, which makes exchanges and returns really easy, is the self-addressed um, postage paid envelope. So anything that needs to go back, just pop it in here, stick it in your mailbox, take it to the post office, and it's just as easy as that. So let's see what we got. See a little box here which usually means jewelry and that never hurts my feelings oh, box. Ooh, pretty little drop earrings I wear things like this frequently so that's really nice those are the Kansas drop earrings in silver and they're $28. Those are cute. And then we have our bundle of clothes here. First off, looks like we have another maxi dress, which I did request again. Pretty blue color, and this is really, really soft. Oh, it's dreamy. So that's pretty. Can't wait to try that on. This would be the Esther Brushed Knit Maxi Dress, and that's $54. Then we have this little top here with the embroidery on it. I'm just not a huge fan of the embroidery and it's kind of a crepey material which is not particularly soft we'll try it on and see how it looks i have other things similar to that even though i just said i don't like the embroidery i 
did pick some and I have kept them. So I guess they're going by that. Uh, that's Market and Spruce Embroidery Detail. And that is $58. Next, we have another top in black, obviously. And it has the little tie detail down there at the bottom. I do like that style a lot. I was hoping for more summer colors. I have a lot of black and gray in my wardrobe already so even if I like that it may go back just because I have so much black and I really want the summer style and colors that is the not front knit top and it is $34 and then we have some Cute red shorts by Dear John. I really like the styling on those, and I'm still desperate for shorts. So those are the Finnegan short by Dear John, and those are red, and they are $58. Now, if you remember last time I had, when I did my fashion and stitch fix, I had a pair of shorts that were $55, and I was really wavering on those mostly because of the price. I loved them. Otherwise, I did end up keeping them. So um, I don't know about red. We'll try them on, see how they fit, and we'll go from there. So hang on just a minute, and we'll give these a shot. Okay, so here's the first outfit we have the red shorts and black shirt with the tie and it's really comfortable but I don't think I want any more black shirts in my wardrobe the shorts are very comfortable but $58 for shorts again two in a row I just don't know what do you think? Keep running into the couch. Let's try another one. Okay, so here is the blue top with the shorts. It is, I like the cut, but I do not like the fabric. It is just not, I don't know if you can see the texture here, but it is just not comfortable. So I don't think this is going to be a go. I don't know. What do you think? Let me know. Okay, here is the maxi dress. Camera angle isn't great for this. The more I'm going to get so you can see this. I wasn't planning ahead very well for this kind of shot, but I really like this. It's so soft. It um, fits really well. And I do like the tank um, cut on it. And the colors are summery. Yeah, what do you think? It's a good length for me too, in case I haven't mentioned I'm five foot four. So a lot of times maxi dresses will come too long and this one is just right. We've got a little room at the ankles, so a cute um, sandal or even wedges would go well with this, so. I don't know. What do you think? Let me know down below what you think about this and all the other pieces from my July Stitch Fix. And as always, there is a referral link below. You get $25 off your first fix and I get a $25 credit towards a future future purchase. So it's a win-win for both of us. Once you become a subscriber, then you can also get referrals 
and get free clothes. So I hope you're having a wonderful day. I do love that you took the time to spend a little time with me today and I look forward to seeing you next time. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye.